Hey, what's going on everybody? And in this video, we'll be talking about a Chrome extension that you can use for Facebook to remove inactive friends. It's called Friend Filter, and we'll go ahead and dive right into my computer and show you guys exactly what it does. Okay guys, we're inside of my computer here and obviously we're logged into Facebook. So when you grow your Facebook friends list, you will eventually reach a point to where you need to remove some people on your Facebook friends list, okay? I actually used a tool to grow my friends list, but for this video, we're talking about an app that removes inactive friends. The reason being is um, the basically the more people you have that do not engage with your posts and your content will actually weigh your account down and your posts will not get as much exposure. So the strategy here is we want to remove those inactive people to boost our engagement. So ultimately we get more leads and more sales on Facebook. Okay. So that's the strategy. So on the front side, I use a tool called uh, friend connector that I actually sell myself and I'm actually one of the founding partners, but on the reverse side, I use this app friend filter to delete all the inactive people. And it's a pretty robust app guys. So, um, as an example of basically good posts, just to show you guys like this one's getting 46. I've had one just recently that got like 70 or 80 plus. Um, so I'm getting pretty good engagement on some of these posts. So that one had 42. Obviously, I could have more of that one 39 um, here. That one had 73. And if I keep scrolling down, I have one. I believe that's like at over 120. So that's pretty good. But I could do better, right? So if we go here, this one added 169 comments. A lot of those comments were me, like half of those. So that's still pretty good, though. Um, those are all the leads that I got from this specific post right here. So half of about half of that was uh, leads. Okay, imagine if I were to pay for those leads, how much that would cost? These posts are for free, so that's why it's super important to get free organic traffic, right? So this one here again uh, at seventy three, about half of those were leads. So I got them in my Facebook group, and my Facebook group has obviously exploded because of those posts. Um, so that's obviously the strategy. All right, so let's just dive into the actual app that will help us grow, right? Um, so it's, it's an extension. You download it to your Chrome browser. Um, you can't really see it here. There's a little icon. You can barely see it in the screen. But uh, once I click it, it brings me to this dashboard, basically. All right, if it doesn't, then you just click dashboard right here. Now, now that we are looking at all this, what does it all mean? So it basically can scan your engagement. Um, I think you can actually set it to in settings here all the way back to 180 days. There's all these other settings you can actually play with right back here. Um, post to fetch per session. You can do go days back to fetch, activities to fetch, shares to fetch, and comments to fetch. And it also has instructions on those. Obviously, the more you increase those settings, the longer it will take to fetch that content and yada yada. So um, just kind of keep it default if you can. If you need to go back farther, that's totally fine. Um, now, this just basically is just tracking your likes, comments, and shares. So this is basically all these inactive people are read here. Um, I actually have to kind of or scan my engagement um, so it can re you know redo all of this. I haven't scanned it in a while um, daily since July, so I don't know if it actually has a last date that I ran this. Um, but it's been a while. But just to show you guys what it does, um, as you can see here, I'm about at the 5,000 friend mark, so I'm getting close to actually needing to uh, mandatorily do this, okay? You can do this at any point in time. Um, you can do it routinely, once a week, however you wanna set your schedule um, on how you wanna use this tool. It's entirely up to you, but for me, I'm gonna wait till I get to 5,000 friends and go ahead and scrub my friends list, all right? With this sync engagement, what we'll do is we'll click that button and I, it will, I will show you guys what it does. So what it's gonna do here is it's gonna go back to on my posts here and start scanning the engagement. As you can see here, I'm not touching anything. <laughs> As you can see, it's just doing the work, right? 
Um, so it's going through there, looking at likes, comments, all that good stuff. And it's just going through there, doing that automatically. Now you can step away from your computer, go do whatever you, it is you do, hang out with family, eat dinner, hang out with your friends, Netflix and chill, whatever you guys want to do. It doesn't matter, right? So it's just going to do its thing. Obviously, this is going to take a while, so we're not going to stick around and wait for that to finish. Um, so we'll go ahead and close this page out, but as you can see, it's not too bad. It's pretty quick for fetching a lot of con. I mean, some of these posts had a lot of comments on them, so it's going to take a little bit. Now on the flip side, it can sync your friends list. Obviously you want to, you want it to track your friends, right? So I can come here and have it scan my friends. Essentially it looks exactly the same, right? So it does the friends, uh, pretty quick so as you can see there you can see it working through quite a few friends at a time and now when we go to friends here we can we have a few different um, categories we have active friends we have inactive we have whitelisted we have unfriended um, friends but basically what we want to do here is we want to click on inactive and if we want some if we want to get rid of some inactive people we can just click here click unfriend and it's gonna obviously unfriend them, right? So it's just gonna do that thing right there, and before you know it, you're not friends with that person anymore. So that's pretty sweet, right? So we're not gonna let that finish though. Um, I can hold down shift if I want to select the entire page here, and then add to the unfriend right here, or um, that's pretty much what I can do. So, um, vice versa what i can do is i can also come in here and whitelist somebody so say if let me see if i can find somebody that i actually might want to whitelist let's see anyways we will uh right here we can uh just click here add to whitelist and that person will not get deleted so that way if we're coming through here and just deleting all these inactive people no big deal right um you can also sl click select all or you can just do like a portion if you hold down shift so like shift hold down that um select none invert selection yada yada those are just small details but uh that's pretty much it guys like you know obviously once you unfriend people your engagement is going to be a lot better um as you can see this chart's kind of a little funky since i've been trying to run it but um you guys get the idea so the better the more friends that are engaged with your content obviously the better we've already explained that at the beginning of the video so this is why you'd want to do that that's and it shows your top friends obviously there um you can see all friends like you know all the people that are engaging with your content so if you want to go in there and message them and say hey thanks for engaging with my content you know and drop them a free um whatever right so that's pretty much it guys that's the strategy um on how to use friend filter what it is used for why you want to use it so that's a complete review so obviously on the flip side um, i do have a special tool for you guys um, if you guys are interested i'll also have a link for that in the description below but as i've also done a lot of videos on this tool my tool that i use to grow uh, my uh, Facebook friends list as you can see here I can target people by keyword but that's another video guys but right now friend filter go ahead and pick up a copy I promise you guys you guys will like it it's awesome it's an incredible way to um, boost your engagement grow your Facebook list and um, have you know engaging fans on your Facebook friends list so with that being said guys you guys know what to do if you guys like this video if you don't like it you also know what to do but Hit the subscribe button, hit the bell, notification, and I will see you guys in the next video and at the bank. Later.